a very good afternoon to everyone who is here with us right now. My name is Tony Areo, aka Mr. Twa, and today we are excited because we have one of the biggest DJs in the land uh, gracing our show, and uh, we're going to catch up on very many things, music, uh, DJing, yeah, we're going to talk just along that line. So, uh, if you're not yet subscribed to our channel, this is Into Deep Promotions, and uh, you can subscribe on the video, leave a comment on what you want to see in our next video. You're most welcome, my brother. Thank you, bro. Mm. It's such a pleasure to be here. Mm. Yeah, man. So, introduce yourself and tell people about what they need to know about DJing and oh. everything around it. Hey yo, what's up people? What's up my beautiful people? So for a Frisco DJ, yeah, the lady's choice, the superstar DJ himself, you know. <laughs> Very nice being around, you know. <laughs> Let's catch up. I got a lot of stuff to tell you all, man. Hey, <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> thank you so much for yeah, coming. Yeah, man. Bless up, bless up, bless up, bless up. Uh, now, uh, there are some things I want you to tell us mm. about DJing. Yeah, man. Uh, first, I, I would like to know, uh, why did you want to work as a DJ? Well, first and foremost, um, I got love for music, long mm. time. Mm. You know me, man. Mm. Music, music's like, it's like in the family, you know. Mm. Yeah. So uh, I got a couple of brothers of mine that do music. I'm like, you know what? Why don't I do something close to music? Mm. Yeah. I master my own crafts. So mm. I decided to become a DJ. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's passionate part of it. Mm. And um, yeah, basically that's it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's been it's, it's been a minute. Mm. Yeah, in the industry, and I love what we're really doing right mm. now. Yeah. And mm. I know many people appreciate us for what we're doing. Mm. Yeah, for that time, it's good for mm. yeah. So how long have you been a DJ? Uh, I started DJing quite some time back. Let me see, it's 2012. How mm. many years? I mean, it's almost, uh, <laughs> almost 10 years. <laughs> yeah. Almost 10 years in the game, bro. Mm. Yeah. So when you look at yourself right now, and then you throw back on how you started. What can you say? Man, it's, 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 not, been a easy, it's not been a easy journey. Huh? Mm. You know, there are always challenges. Mm. There's always challenges on the way. Uh, you know, way back when you, when, when you say you're a DJ, you know the expectation of everyone. I said, this guy, uh, too much Bombay, he's spoiled, he has no future. And what. But right now, the way we have built the whole thing, everyone is is running after you they want to become a dj you're like man almost every single day i'm receiving calls you know mm. your bro i want you to train me i want to be like you and what mm. so i'm happy at least where we are what you're doing is inspiring yeah, a lot of youth yeah a there. lot of youth outside there mm. yeah man so how do you stay up with the the latest up-to-date music trends uh basically um you know right now we have got the internet mm. Like for me personally, I'm always following up what uh, the top 100 songs that are out playing. Mm. Yeah, there's a site that we normally go and do research on. Basically, research is the most important thing. Mm. Yeah, not only the latest, even back in the days. Mm. Yeah, you know, music is not just music is why. Mm. Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> so uh, there, there are lots of complaints out there that mm -hmm. Frisco DJ doesn't mm. play low music mm -hmm. a lot in his mixes. Mm. Why? Wow. Okay, that's a very good question. Mm. Uh, not that I don't play a lot of low music, but I really I love low music. So mm. if, 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 I, if I start seeing where low music came from, man, right now, I can tell you, if I'm to compare low music with this Western Asia, our mm. music is the best right about now. Mm. But trust me, the production has changed, the mm. videos have changed, quality mm. is there right now. Mm. And yes, you, you might blame me way back. Yeah, I will allow way back. I used to re really put less emphasis on raw music but right now mm. trust me my playlist you're going to find at least <laughs> yeah, at least 60 percent is low music is low music because i'm a guy from the land we have to support each other we have to push the industry outside there uh, yeah so what, what 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 can you tell the artists out there uh on what to do to catch up with the next trends or to work on projects that at least can be playable or can be in your playlist well that's very simple uh, first thing is first, mm. this artist should stop being self-centered, mm. stop being comfortable. Mm. Yeah, you know, you wake up in the morning, you make a hit, you just, you just you know what, 
mm. <laughs> you're not thinking of, of what else to do mm. production wise go to the best studios spend mm. that money mm. trust me invest and you get mm. yeah that's so, it in other words they have to treat music as a business as a business it's, it's, it's a business just like yeah, yeah. music is a business yeah. even djing all is in the business it's a business my brother yeah, yeah man <laughs> okay <laughs> So, Frisco DJ. Yes, brother. <laughs> now, yeah, uh, what skills do you think DJs need to be successful? The skills that you need mm. to be successful as a DJ. Mm. Mm. Uh, uh, that, that's, that's quite simple. Mm. Um, first and foremost, you should do music. Mm. Do research. Mm. Master your crowd. Now mm. you study the crowd that's like you. Before mm. going for any gig, mm. always do a homework mm. before going for any program outside mm. there. Mm. That is it. It's just simple. Just that? Just that. Eh. Do your research. Make a lot of noise on social media. Eh. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, DJ, DJ this, I'm going to be here. And what? Man, these days it's not like back in the days. Things are just simple. Eh. Social media simplifies everything. No okay. way but we used to hustle a lot. Mm. Mm. So, what techniques do you use to engage uh, the people who, okay, the crowd that come for, 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 for your mixes when you're doing your thing. Like the best guys just marketing. Mm. The way you market yourself. Mm. Build your brand. Mm. Make the brand big. Mm -hmm. get, a, get following. Mm. And trust me, at least you, you'll get the people. Uh, yes. So ever since you started being a DJ, uh, what is the most rewarding thing about being a DJ? Man, of course the money. <laughs> <laughs> money, <laughs> money, money. <laughs> money, money, money. Yeah? The money, yeah? the ladies love, man. You know? uh, that they are screaming, yo, Frisco, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, what is the best thing mm. that has ever happened to you when you were just doing your mixes? Wow. The best thing that has ever happened to me. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I call it the best thing. Anyway, the craziest thing. The craziest right? thing, okay. <laughs> this lady removes the bra and throws it on the stage. They're like, they're like okay. <laughs> like, this chick is feeling me this much. <laughs> that's way back. That was really mad. Yeah? Uh, <laughs> so, yeah. did you like uh, happen to meet up after or uh, when you finish your thing, you just. You know. <laughs> After finishing, man, you get some other program where to go next. Uh, yeah, no, nothing like sitting around. Mm. Yeah. So, uh, what are some of the challenges you you faced as a DJ? Um, basically, in the industry, mm. the challenges are not I normally face. I faced before the, mm. the hard ones. Mm. Uh, there's this thing called monopoly. Way back in Gulu, mm. in the city, here. not even Gulu. You know, we have like a few bars. Mm. Yeah. So that's how. The, the so called bar owners attend to what? To, should I say, divest you or control you? What mm. to do and what? Mm. Yeah. So challenging. Mm. Mm. You can't do any other gig outside. Mm. No, like, no, like right now, you can go anywhere you feel like. You mm. have a program, you can go, you can hope anywhere you want to go. Mm. Yeah, because the what? The, the city has just grown now. Mm. Mm. Okay, so music is all the about the money. Yeah, You're true. getting those more gigs. Like to have more money. Of course. So, uh, are you, in other words, trying to say that the money that these bar owners give is small, and you need like to get other gigs so that you can have something reasonable? I'm not saying that it's small. Mm. Uh, you know the money that you get is it's it's, it's according to how your brand is. Mm. Yeah. I cannot wake up in the morning and then I go to a bar. You know, mm. probably I did I did online training on DJing and what, and then I go to a bar, you know, I'm this and this, mm. and nobody knows you, and I want this amount of money, you should pay me, I should pay you. <laughs> so it's all about building, eh? Uh, it's building. Mm. How, how relevant have you been? Mm. Mm. How hardworking have you been? Mm. Uh, yeah. Where so, people be like, man, yeah, man, this guy you've been following him is big and what, yeah. Mm. Trust me, it's good to what? Play you good music. Uh, yeah. So. And uh, another thing, um, where do you do your mixes from? Well, do you do mixes in a club or you just take just bookings? I do, I do all. Mm. I do all. 
Mm. <laughs> I do all, I do the clubs, I do radio, mm. I also do the, the outside gigs. Mm. Try telling us about your nights and uh, where your fans can reach out to you and have some quality time enjoying your mixes. Yeah, well, well, well. Uh, I have I have nights at uh, Password Lounge, mm. right here in Gulu, mm. one of the strangest clubs. You know, I know you all know about it. Yeah. So I always do every Saturday. I do Saturday Night Live. Okay. It's always a turn up. Mm. Also, we have Celebrity Night every Sunday. Mm. Another turn up party. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Those are the two nights I know. Okay. These other days I'll be on my own, my own, my other own business. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, thank you so much for coming through. Man, thank you so much for honoring our request. It's been a blessing. It's been a blessing. Mm. Yeah, I'm blessed of all the fans outside there. You guys are the reason why we, we love doing this, man. Mm. Yeah, without you guys, I uh, have uh, nothing. Mm. Into deep, you've always been supporting <laughs> us from day one, man. Yeah. <laughs> I love what you're doing, man. <laughs> thank you, thank you so blessings, much. Blessings, 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 brother. Mm. Yeah, man. Otherwise, all the best, my brother. Bless up, bless up, bless up. God bless. <laughs> so, uh, what are the top five trending Luo songs in right. your playlist? In my playlist right now. Mm. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> let me start from the top. I mm. think my number five. Mm. It will be Lux's song, Le Cristo. Le Cristo? Yeah. Very, Le Cristo at number five. Very good visual. Mm. Nice sound. Everything mm. is on point. Yeah. That would be my number five, the Crystal Luxem and Big Up, that was a hard jump. Mm. Uh, my number four, my number four, will, I will go with uh, Eddie Luzi. Mm. Eddie Luzi's song, um, it's called uh, the name of Tammy. Of Tammy, with Man CJ. Man, that's sort of another problem, my brother. Yeah. yeah. Hard jump. Mm. Ah. <laughs> that's why now it becomes tricky. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> The third jam right okay the third jam right now is Rogambo. Mm. Easy music. Mm. It's a good banger, club bangers doing really well. well. Mm. Yeah, they're working also the video. So it's gonna be out. Mm. Song number two. Song number two. Mm, number two. Number two. <laughs> yeah. Song number two. Yeah. Everyone is going. Go, Cory. Go, Cory. But, 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 your yeah. list is not having like Kubu Kubu. Why? Breakfast finished. Okay. That one could be a bonus. You never know. <laughs> okay, the bonus will be like Kubu Kubu. Yeah. So, go, Cory, man. Yeah, man, that's a hard jam, man. Mm. All right, man. You did, you did, you did wonders mm. <laughs> to that song. Yeah. yeah. It's a very good song, good video. That's your point. Yeah. And our number one, of course, the mm. famous one. DJ Frisco is a music. Hey, Namo. Namo. Yeah, mega car choke is stressed to my choking hour over. That's hey. the biggest song right now in the club rotating, bro. Okay. Mm, so, region. let's get to the Lakubuku beat. Which is your favorite Lakubuku song? Uh, <laughs> favorite Lakubuku song? Yes. Man, me, man, me, 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 I'm a fan of Boss Miku. Boss Miku team. Penny Tomb, Penny Tomb, I don't want it. You even done Penny Tomb. Thank you so much. God bless you. Mom, so.